What's up? What's up, guys? I'm Pip. I'm going to bring you a reading, see what your person has going on for the week ahead, okay? This is going to be focusing on whatever person that you're thinking of, okay, Leos? I just want to say thank you guys for the love and support you have shown my channel. If it resonates, hit that like button. It sends an energetic donation out to me. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you know when all my future readings come out. This is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Okay, it's not going to be for everybody as it's general, so take what resonates, leave what doesn't. My nails are ratchet as hell, so y'all don't be judging me. <laughs> let's go, let's go. We're going to see what's crowning the spread. Let's see what's crowning the spread for your person. What is crowning the spread for Leo's person spirit? We have the world and blossoming abundance. Ooh, what you don't see, what they don't see coming is a storm warning. Mm, mm, mm. So this person's about to go through hell. They're trying to close out some cycles. They're trying to figure things out because they're doing bad. Uh, spirit has them in a very, very, like with this blossoming abundance being in reverse, it's like this person can't you know, is going through karma right now. They're probably broke as hell. Um, they can't, nothing good is go, going good for them because there's some cycles that they need to close out here and they're not doing it. Okay. You know what that is, but right now they're going through, they're going through this storm right now. Yep. This is what it is. They're dealing with another connection, a karmic connection with this attachment card being here. Okay. They're going through a storm right now. If this person's dealing with the karmic, if they left you for somebody else or, you know, whatever the situation is, they're going through it right now with this person. Fighting, arguing, they're trying to detach themselves from this karmic, okay? But since they're not, we have, they're going through, since they're not closing out this cycle, they're going through hell right now. Let's see, what else is crowning this spread, spirit? For Leo's person. What else is crowning this spread for Leo's person? From the bottom. So this person is trying to use their intuition, okay, to push through. This person is starting to realize that this other connection isn't for them. But the fact of the matter is they're not moving. This person wants your forgiveness, Leo, okay? They want to let go of the past and of any resentment, okay, and move forward. But right now they're stuck in this karmic situation and they're going through hell, the storm. Plus, it's like it's all going bad for them. Manifestation, okay? So they're trying to manifest something in, into their life. They might be trying to manifest you back into their life. Bottom of the deck, the divine masculine. So we're definitely talking about your counterpart, the masculine right now, Leo. Okay. If you are the masculine, then this could be you. Just saying. All right. So this person is definitely about to, like, shit's about to hit the fan with this person. This person is realizing that they have fucked up, that they're in a situation, but they can't get out of it. They're, it it's attachment. It's karmic, right? And it's a cycle that they have to break. If they hurt you, okay, if they put you through hell, they hurt their divine counterpart with this divine masculine being here, okay? And now they're going through it. Now they're going through hell. Now karma is playing a part in their life. But they're not moving. Let's see. Why is this world here? Why is this world here, spirit? Why is this world here for Leo's person? Why is this world card here? The five of wands. Jealousy. Arguments. Fighting. Conflicts. Um, walking away from drama and situations that, they, that are unfulfilling to them. This person has to close out this cycle with this karmic. I'm telling you, and I know, you know, readers bring that shit up, but it's right here with this attachment card and this storm warning. And the blossoming abundance coming out in reverse. This person is going through hell with this karmic. I'm telling you, man. And they have to close that out or else spirit is going to keep on. I mean, it's like not only financially, it's like spiritually, physically, they're fighting. Like spirit is putting them through it. 
they're trying to stand up for themselves to close this cycle out. I feel like a huge fight is going to it's going to ensue between this karmic and your person, okay? And that's going to help close this cycle out. This person is making their divine counterpart feel insecure, feel feel jealous, you, you know? And spirit doesn't like that. And they're reaping they're reaping their karma for that. Why is this blossoming abundance in the reverse here, spirit? They might have put you in a third party situation with that three being there. The Queen of Wands. See what I'm saying? Why is this blossoming abundance? Why are they going through this karma and this blossoming abundance in reverse? Then why are they going through hell? Because of you, the Queen of Wands. Leo energy, right? Because they hurt you. Because they picked somebody else over you, over their divine counterpart. And now spirit is going to make sure that they pay for that. They see that you're beautiful. They see you're abundant. You know, you're passionate, talented. They feel like there's nothing that you can't do, you know? And they know that they need to balance this out. They know they have to, to balance these skills out in order for them to stop going through this spiritual karma. Why is this forgiveness card here, Spirit? Why is this forgiveness card here, Spirit? Oh, shit. The death card. What did I tell you? Transformation. So what that tells me is that they probably did. They might have cheated on you, put it, put you in a third party situation. There was an ending here somewhere that they went off and could be with somebody else or hurt you for somebody else. And now they want your forgiveness. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's why that forgiveness card is here is because they hurt you. They know that they've chose somebody over you. I feel like they also know that time is running out when it comes to you, Leo. Okay? And that they're going to they're gonna have to make this choice here. And this card literally says a significant life experience that requires changes to be made. I'm telling you, spirit is putting them through this. Through hell. Through a significant spiritual growth. Because right under the Divine Masculine card is spiritual maturity. Okay? They are definitely going through a transformation here. And they're realizing that time is ticking, right? And you're going to end up holding resentment for this person for what they've done. They need to come forward. They're definitely trying to let go of their old belief systems the way they used to be. They're trying to change. They are leveling up spiritually because I'm telling you they're going through it right now. They're learning. They're realizing that they've hurt their divine person. They're starting to realize you can't go through life hurting people um, that have only had true intentions for you. Why is this acceptance here, spirit? Yep, because they, look, they made they, they were confused. They had a lot of options and they made a choice. They made the wrong choice, okay? And now this person knows like it's like for a long time they procrastinated on letting go of this karmic situation even though they knew in their head that that was the best thing to do. They were holding on to it, holding on to it, but now they're at the point where they went through so much shit and so much karma that now they're accepting that that they cannot hold on to it anymore and it's time for them to make a choice. It literally says it on the card. Stop procrastinating. Get clarity on what they really want and move forward. Okay, this person could also have some sexual addictions, uh, alcohol addictions, drug addictions, okay, but I, I see this is just really them, them having to make this decision here where they have not wanted to make a choice for so long, now it's like spirit is pushing them, like, okay, if you're not going to move, we're going to move forward, we're going to move for you, we're going to force you to make this decision. But I feel like this karmic also is not wanting to let this person go, making it very, very difficult for this person to make a decision. Why is this manifestation here, spirit? Why is this manifest? Thank you. The queen of pentacles and the five of swords. Okay, spirit come through. They made an un they might have went and married this other person. I'm just going to be honest with you, okay? They might have this five of swords literally says an unwise choice. Um this person might have went and married this karmic person, okay? And now they're realizing how bad they fucked up. If that's not the situation, okay? Or they could be married to the karmic. 
But if that's not the situation, this person wants to marry you. And they have realized that they have made the wrong choice here. They're realizing that there is definitely a better way, something that's going to make them happier, okay? But it's like, because this karmic that they went to, okay, whatever they're dealing with, they have no integrity. No, you know, just... The person is using them, okay? Questionable motives. They, they don't know. You know, this person, it, I feel like, is a very sneaky individual. But I feel like your person is also a very sneaky individual. What happened with this karmic or the way they're dealing with this karmic, um, they're definitely not doing it in the right way. They definitely want to manifest you back into their life, okay? But I feel like they 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 have realized that they made the wrong choice when it came to 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 choosing their partner here, and now they're trying to manifest um, this Queen of Wands back into their life. See, but they done they I feel like this person has done too much, or they've gone in too deep with this karmic energy with that attachment. But I feel like a huge fight is gonna blow up with it with this karmic. Just a huge fight could blow up between the two of you, Leo. I'm just going to be honest. Why is this Bible warm, sister? The Knight of Cups. See, the problem is that this person that your person is in love with you right this person is going through hell in this other situation there's absolutely no balance okay it's like they feel stuck and they're ready to move forward they're ready to off to make you an offer they're ready to take their cup move forward come to you with an apology tell them tell you they love you tell you you know everything that they've been wanting to say because they're going through it with this other person. I feel like your person is closing out a cycle right now with a karmic person, okay, to come towards you. Because this Knight of Cups is facing this Queen of Wands, okay? They're leaving behind this fighting and argument and going towards this Queen of Wands. Is this, so what was this choice that this person made? I feel like it definitely has to do with this this other person. What was this unwise choice, Spirit? What was this unwise choice? Okay, so they just they just moved forward really quickly. They didn't plan um, what they were doing. It was like you found out that they were dealing with somebody else or something happened and they just moved forward. It's like they didn't think it through and plan right before they made this decision right it was like spur of the moment sudden change right so now it's like this person is waiting on the perfect timing and trying to plan a way to get back to you and and out of this karmic situation i feel like spirit is definitely watching over this connection okay and helping this person move forward and push this along. Why is this death card spirit? What's coming to an end? What's coming to an end spirit? So this person is going to come to finish what they started with you, Leo, okay? This person is ready to end this other situation. They know time is what is kicking and they're coming towards you because they know they're ready to finish whatever this is that they started with you and make things right. They want this passionate new beginning with you with that one wand on there, okay? Let's see. What about this karmic spirit? Can you tell me a little bit more about this karmic? What, what this person and this karmic has going on spirit? What Leo's person and this karmic has going on spirit? What Leo's person and this karmic has going on spirit? Thank you. 
It could be a money thing, okay, that they're dealing with. It, I feel like this person feels like they didn't work very, very hard on that connection. They put a, they put all of their their eggs in one basket, and now it's not working out. Okay, um, I feel like this. I feel like this person. Um, I feel like it's definitely a money thing because these are both pentacles out here, okay? The 9 plus 7 is what? 16, 6 plus 1, yeah. This person put all their eggs in the wrong basket. They worked very, very hard on the wrong situation here. But I feel like this per this karmic person that they're dealing with is very abundant. Got her shit together, you know what I'm saying? And this, this karmic could be using money against your person. You know, this karmic could also, like, um, always buy your person things, you know what I'm saying, to overindulge and to keep them there. It's like they use money and gifts and sex, etc., etc., to keep your person. Tell me a little bit more about this karmic. This karmic. And will Leo's person walk away from this karmic spirit? Will Leo's person walk away from this karmic spirit? Thank you. We have the four of pentacles. See, I'm telling you, um, definitely, definitely, um, this situation, I feel like your person is very, very bored in. They're very, very unhappy. They're closed off. Their heart chakra is closed off. They're not speaking, you know, everything. They're not trying to let on to this person how they're feeling. Okay, and the fact of the matter is the reason why it's difficult for them to leave this karmic is because they're trying to manage their money very, very carefully. I feel like this person might try to take them for everything they have. Um, I feel like this person plays with their emotions, makes them feel guilty if they want to walk away. And they're really not seeing um, the good things and walk away. They're just seeing this in black and white. Like if I leave, this person is going to take me for this. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, ego. The devil card, right? That's the karmic right there. The illusion of being trapped. So it's like this person, I literally just said this, and this person thinks that they're stuck there. They're not seeing things for what it is if they were really to walk away from that situation. It's like it's time for them to make, make choices that makes them happy. But they have some unhealthy habits, maybe some addictions, you know what I'm saying, that is keeping this person stuck in this karmic situation. All right. All right. That's your reading for about your person for right now, Leo. Check out my midweek. Until next time, peace.